Um, so you know I directed you I did yes. and it's an honor to meet you I mean yeah I mean yeah, to be able to I mean see the animation though in this way yeah. I mean after so long since the Lion King I mean we were just talking to Chris and Jennifer and Peter about Frozen right uh, one critic at the LA Times said that uh, that film, Frozen, is if not as good or is as good as The Lion King. What do you think of that? What do you, I mean, for, for, for a director, for someone who's been there, kind of, uh, do you think Disney Animation has it this time, or I mean... Oh, I, I, I think, yeah, I was, I was, I love the film. I, I had a great time. And Chris Buck is, is really uh, a, a great, a dear friend and, and an old friend. I actually met Chris Buck when I started at Disney. Oh, okay. Back in 1983, yeah. So it was uh, it was a long time ago. History, history, and a lot of good talent coming out from that studio as well. Um, so for your film, particularly now, uh, Mr. Sherman, and Mr. Peabody, right? Mr. Peabody, Mr. Peter Sherman. This is bad. We might have to redo all of this, but I mean, yes, back to one. Yeah, back to one. But I mean, for this film, um, are you taking that type of storytelling um, uh, that you did in, in Lion King, that the skills that you learned at Disney, yeah. into something like this now? Well, yeah. I mean, you know, I've always tried to, to apply those things that I learned at Disney in, in all the films that I've made. Uh, I had such a great uh, experience, and I was so fortunate uh, to work there uh, when I did. It was really a, a, a great time. Uh, you know, and I got to work on movies like The Little Mermaid and Beauty and the Beast uh, leading up to The Lion King, which was for me my first, uh, you know, feature film as a director. Right. I'd actually directed a couple of Roger Rabbit shorts. I'm mm -hmm. not sure if you've seen them, but um, but I, I had great experiences. In fact, one of the great things that uh, that happened to me when I was a kid, actually, I was going to CalArts, yep. and I got invited. I got it, all the animators together. I got invited to uh, to do a summer internship with Eric Larson, who is one of the original Nine Old Men, okay. who'd actually worked directly with Walt, Walt Disney. Yeah. Uh, and the time that I spent with him was just, you know, changed my life. Yeah, and, and drifted over into the things that you're doing now. Are you going to remain in animation? Is animation your thing 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 years down the road? <laughs> well, you know, it's 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 in your blood, you know. You, yeah. you never really leave it. Uh, you know, it's something that I've loved since I was a kid, and I still love it today. Yeah, it's something that, uh, uh, for sure, uh, has stood the test of time. Absolutely. Um, and now we're celebrating it in, in with, with colleagues and friends that I'm sure that you know here. So um, congrats on the success of the film already. You know, we're looking forward to seeing it, but I mean, I'm a big fan of Lion King. We're just putting it out there right now. So yeah, um, thank, thank you, you again much. so much for your time. Sure. Thank you.